Hey YouTube, it's your girl Jazz and I'm back with another video. Today's video will be on a double unboxing from Kate Spade. So if you want to see the items that I got, keep on watching. I see you look good out on me, no lashes, even better when you're waiting, I see the look on your face. Alright y'all, welcome back to my channel. Thank y'all so much for clicking on my face and seeing what item that I got. So I'm so excited about this item seen it online like when I'm scrolling on Facebook it just kept popping up and I'm like okay and then you know Kate's this is from Kate Spade Outlet actually and if y'all are like me and see the ads and then it was like 70% off you like okay 70% off is actually a deal what we talking about so let's get right into my double unboxing so this is the box I just got it today and I'm so excited about this because I hadn't ordered a Kate Spade bag in a minute I think last year I got um was it two bags from them was it last year I know like the mini Manhattan so actually that wasn't last year that was um 2022 that I got um those bags so yeah, it's been a minute. So I'm just doing my true unboxing right now. Oh. Do I want to start off with the big item or the small item? Uh, since the small one is right on top, we might as well get into it. Alright, so the first item that I've got is this beautiful bangle. And it's in honor of Pride Month because as you know, June is Pride Month. And y'all, look at this... <laughs> bangle I just thought it was so cute I don't know if it's showing for real for real if y'all can see the beauty of the bangle of course I'll show it to y'all at another view another point of view but it just has like the rainbow going across with the rhinestones and it's gold hardware of course and y'all know I love my gold hardware bangles you just make sure this fits on my wrist all right it does so there it is. So this is item number one. So freaking cute. All right. Now let's get into the big one. So love this bracelet. And I love that the rhinestones go all the way around. And they better not fall off because I'm going to be upset. <laughs> but let's get right into the next one. All right. This one took up the whole bag or the whole box. No receipt. Oh, you know what? No receipt because it's um final sale. It was final sale only. So y'all, yeah, this is the bag. And I was trying to like look for like a real life um image of the bag. I saw one TikTok, but I was just like, I feel like I'ma like the bag regardless because it's a unique bag, a bag I don't have in my collection. Do I have any bags this shape? I don't think so so yeah this is definitely my first so this is the Kate Spade heart bag and it's in honor of the pride collection like I mentioned it is pride month June is pride month and y'all know I love my color so I'm always excited this is so pretty I'm always excited to see like what pride collections um like um coach and kate spade like what pride collections they come out with every year because i know i love color and i just you know want them to have fun with it and this is the first time that um i seen that kate spade um did it um this year and i was actually interested in the pieces because i think it's what it was two years ago um coach had pride in their outlet and i got um the sneakers and the rowan satchel but now i have this beauty to add to my collection so it's a heart bag this is a good size bag and it just has um kate spade new york and it has a spade there and it's just in the rainbow colors so i thought this was so cute very unique i can't wait to put an outfit together with this before the month ends and i just love it i just think it's so different i definitely don't have nothing like this in my collection one is heart shaped and then two it's a navy bag i do not have any navy purses because i don't really care for the color navy but 
because of how cute this is how cute this is i love the rainbow that it has going on and then it has the white leather trim going around i was just like man let me go ahead and get this so this is um my pride piece for the year 2024 and i'm excited so let me i'm trying to take off the um all the packaging but this is so cute like i just feel like you can wear a lot of outfits with this i feel like i say that with all of my bags that i get like oh the outfits are endless but for me it really is because i'm naturally a colorful person so all my pieces in my closet is colorful. So that's why I feel like I could always make things work. All right, y'all. I'm trying to get this in my ass. Where's my box cutter? This is where the box cutter comes in handy. Y'all, so here's another look at the bag. I think this is so cute. Oh my goodness. And then like the material that they use, I don't know how to explain it. Let me just zoom in so y'all could see the material for the um letters that go across. All right. I think I kind of want to do a what fits inside real quick. So this is just the packaging. Oh my goodness, all this packaging. No dust bag. That's all right, that's all right. All right, so this is the inside of the bag. I don't even know what material to call this. Like, let me see what this is called. Okay, so the name of the bag, the official name is the Rainbow Collection Love Shack Heart Tote. And the details, let's get into it. Okay, so it's canvas and smooth leather. So that's the material. So of course this is the canvas part and then the white um, lining that would be the leather material. So I like that it's structured so of course it's going to stay a heart. So let me stand up so y'all can see the details. So this is the bag. I'll do a mod shot really quickly. Um, this is how it looks open and then it does have a zipper. So I'll take that off. So it does have a zipper so you can close it, keep all your items protected. This side is open and then this side of it is open. But overall, your item should stay, you know, intact in this bag. But yeah. So this is how the bag looks on me. Real cute. Like this. With a white dress. Yeah, I think she's so cute. Oh my goodness it's so unique like because i don't have nothing like it all right y'all so i went downstairs to um get my bag that i have and i'm gonna do a bag switch with y'all so we can see what fits in my new bag so let's get started all right y'all so these are usually my essentials that i have card holder compact mirror fan especially now that we're in the summertime my um, mini pochette where it houses like my lip my lippies mainly and like a pen um, my airpods my keys oh this is actually supposed to be this way my keys um some sunnies um portable charger this is my new pair of headphones i've actually been wearing a lot more i got them from amazon for like under 30 bucks and y'all i actually love these more than my um airpods quickly let me show y'all so they like hug around your ear which i appreciate and i love that it's pink and girly so yeah love these and the warranty on these are awesome all right so i think right now yeah i put the um toiletry um 19 in there just to see like you know what else can fit so i'm just gonna add more onto it so again the bag is going to be tilted and the straps they kind of in the way but all right so this is my mini pressure it's going to add that right in there so everything should fit good to be honest all of the stuff that i carry because me i don't carry a lot as is like if this stuff can't fit in any of my purse then more than likely, I really don't need the purse because 
especially carrying it to work so yeah all of my items will fit for sure oops that's the thing now everything is just sliding <laughs> And y'all know I'm going to keep it real with my bag reviews. I ain't never had a heart bag before. So, I don't know how I feel. It's pretty, but why is it, why are you leaning? <laughs> but yes, see, when I have her held up, like, this just makes me so happy. Like, I love it. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> Anybody that has a heart-shaped bag, like, how do y'all feel, like... Because, you know, bags are supposed to, like, sit up like this. So, like, this is very different to me. Like, I'm feeling a type of way, but I love the bag. Like, and I know when I take my pictures, I'm going to, of course, hold the bag up upright. But it's just, like, <laughs> putting her down. Like, how am I going to take a picture, like, at a lunch table or if I want to bring her to brunch? <laughs> I know it's petty, but dang. But anyway, nonetheless, y'all, she does carry a good amount. So now I do want to switch it and see, like, if my planner will fit or um, an iPad, you know, just to see. By the way, I am just here for all of my pink vibes that I have going on. I am just a girl. <laughs> all right, so let's, oops, let's try the iPad since it's the largest item. Just want to see if it'll at least lay in here. And the answer is no. Like, yeah an uh, ipad can't fit yeah no 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 all right the last item is like my pocket journal it's not really a pocket size it's a little bit bigger but um i do want to see if this fits because if that fits then i at least know that um my pocket agenda planner that i ordered it will fit so yeah this definitely fits in there just fine no issues and then i'm pretty sure the rest of this stuff will fit in there too i'm not gonna put the toiletry in there not both because i never use both it's one or the other so i know the rest of the stuff will fit all right y'all so this is everything so everything fits in there just fine all right so this is how it looks another mod shot excuse the mess on my floor <laughs> It has a lot of packaging that comes in it, but I like it. And I like how it lays on the crook of my arm as well. Real cute. And this is how it looks. Shoulder. Real cute. All right, y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this double unboxing. I will see y'all in the next one. Love y'all. Bye. Okay.